Back. Hope you had a great weekend. I did. Had lots of fun. Great weather. Enjoyed outside. I hope you guys were able to get outside. It was not great on Friday. And I'm not sure about this week. The weather reports don't look great. I have one announcement before we get going. Mackenzie. Mackenzie earned a star. It is her fifth star. I do not know what color Mackenzie wants, and so I am going to get her a silver star. Mackenzie, if you do not love the silver color that I am getting for you. You can change it when we see you again, okay? So, congratulations, Mackenzie. You get to color this clip. Make sure you're letting me know if you get uh, three clips up in a day. And by the way, tell me what color you get so I don't have to guess. Okay, um, let's get started with our opening today. Oh my goodness, I can see I did not set my camera very well. Let's get that set the right way so we don't have any problemos. Let's see, well, let's come over here, right into, yeah, perfect, good. All right, I am going to be getting this kind of square today. Did you know it was this one? The small. We're on a small today. This is the B part, no, the C part of our pattern. Small is the C. Remember, it goes big, medium, small, medium. A, B, C, B. It's our pattern today. What number am I going to write on here? Why, I am going to be writing the number 23. 23, whose cubby number is 23? Congratulations to Nala. It's your day today. Sorry to Logan Grand and Claire. We missed you over the weekend. Well, you'll have another chance. Here we go. 23 up and around and down and back on the railroad track. Doot, doot. Around and around like a bumblebee. That's the way to make a three, buzz, buzz, buzz. Now I'm gonna go over here and grab a Unifix cube. Yep, I forgot to get one before I wrote the number. Sometimes it's hard for me to get all the, the steps ready when I'm doing everything, but uh, that's all right. Let's stick the 23 up here and put this up onto our Unifix cubes. I have two 10 sticks and one three stick. That's two groups of 10 and three ones. That makes the number 23. That's what I wrote on the paper. And now let's find out what today is. I see on the calendar that today is Monday. It's Monday. What song do I want to sing today? Well, I would like to sing The Adams Family. You ready? Here we go. Days of the week. 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 
There's Sunday and there's Monday. There's Tuesday and there's Wednesday. There's Thursday and there's Friday. And then there's Saturday. Days of the week. Oops, days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week. Days of the week. So today is Monday, March. Let me say that. 23rd, March 23rd, 2020. Let's get a straw, a straw, a straw, a straw, you say. Here is a straw. Okay, I'm going to put the straw in the one's pocket. Do you know how many straws are in the one's pocket? I do. There are nine. No, not the German. No, I'm saying I'm saying the number nine. You ready? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, Get back in there, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine. Let's count them by twos. Two. Four, six, eight, and one left over. Nine is our last odd digit. Let's count them by threes, you say. Three. S whoa, 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 whoa. It's almost a disaster. A calamity. Hip, hip, hooray. Six and nine. Nice. Okay, I was right, there were nine, but this is wrong, he's fired! Let's go get a number nine. Okay, well, we're gonna take a little, while I try and find the number nine, there's gotta be two nines in here because we used them already, I found one of them. Remember when we had 99? That was Two nines, nine tens and nine ones. We have nine ones again. Okay, how many groups of ten are there? Why? There's two. One, two. Two groups of ten, count them by twenties. I mean, you know, not by twenties, by tens. Ten, twenty, all right. I have a feeling that's not going to stay very long for long. And one group of hundred. If we have one group of hundred, you guys see that? One group of hundred. Yeah, I thought I pushed that down all the way. I get a line. Oh, whatever. One group of hundred, two groups of ten, nine ones. That's the number one hundred twenty-nine. Today is the one hundred twenty-ninth day of kindergarten. We have been in kindergarten a long time. I'm going to go get a piece of paper so I can write 129. What color am I getting, guys? Come on, you can tell me what color am I getting. Why, well, I'm getting brown. If you said brown, you were right. All right, now I'm going to bring this back up again because we need to be able to look at those numbers. Yep, here we go. A straight line down is lots of fun. That's the way to make a one. Up and around and down and back on the railroad track. Toot, toot. A balloon and a straight line. That makes a great nine. Here it is, guys. 129. Let's put it up on the board. All the way over here, I'm gonna grab a piece of tape so it doesn't fall off. Watch out, oh my goodness. I'm gonna to have to move that pretty soon. Here it comes. Bam, the 129th day of school. Excellent. Okay, next thing we gotta do is the weather, of course. I looked up in the sky today and wondered, what's the weather? Mm, 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 
wonder what's the weather. Did you go out and look outside? Right now, as I was driving up to school, I saw clouds and I saw sun. And I'm kind of up in the air about what we're going to say. What does it say? It says cloud. <sighs> Let me click and see what the guest is. What is mm. I sun today, so I think I'm going to color in sunny. I looked up in the sky today and sunny was the weather. S U N N Y. S U N N Y. S U and NY and sunny was the weather. Whew. That means that is still in the lead for the month of March. Last Thursday and Friday, remember we colored in our first rainy and snowies for March. Okay, I looked up at Mr. Burnett's computer and wondered what the temperature was. I knew it was pretty warm today. It's 40 degrees outside. 40 yesterday, or Friday, it was 32 degrees. So 32's right there. 40 over there. My goodness, that is quite a bit warmer. I knew it today because uh, this morning, my house was not very cold. I was turning the heat off during the night, and then it has to come back up again, but it did not get very cold in my house last night. 40 degrees, that's another warm one. Gets us up above January again. February was quite a bit colder. 40 goes right there. Let's draw a line. Do you see this, or do you just see my head? It's mostly head, isn't it? Sorry about that. All right, let's take a look at our roller coaster for March. How's it looking? You see it's gone up above January again. February was way down there. Stayed cold during the last part of February. Well, is it going to get colder later this week? Mmm, you should watch the weather and see. Okay, that's it for now. We're ready to get this uploaded. You guys have a great day of learning. Try and get uh, reading and math up in the next hour or so. I don't have any other meetings or anything, so I will see you in a little while.